Visual Studio Code and Sublime Text are both excellent text editors for programming. But which one of the two is better? Let's have a look and compare both options. Sublime is a commercial solution while Visual Studio Code is open source. Sublime Text is a one-time purchase for $99, but can basically be used for free as long as you can live with some annoying pop-up messages every once in a while. Visual Studio Code on the other side is available completely for free. Let's first have a look at performance. Visual Studio Code is based on the Electron framework. Sublime is implemented in C++ and Python. It therefore loads more quickly and consumes minimal memory. But both text editors are very responsive once they are loaded. Now both Visual Studio Code and Sublime are supported for Mac, Windows and macOS. Refactoring is something that is very well supported in IDEs. Text editors on the other side typically only have limited refactoring support. Visual Studio Code, for instance, has some refactoring support when setting up rope. Some supported refactoring actions are, for instance, renaming, extracting a method, and extracting a variable. Sublime Text on the other side does not have any significant refactoring functions. When we look at debugging, Visual Studio Code has a separate debug mode that can be used to step through the code. The debug panel on the left displays local and global variables, call stacks, and breakpoints. The debugger works well with many different languages. Sublime Text, on the other hand, requires setting up build systems. You can install the Python debugger package for debugging. So while debugging works in Sublime, it lacks some of the features that Visual Studio Code provides. Syntax highlighting is a must-have feature for development and fast code completion is very beneficial. VS Code and Sublime both support syntax highlighting and code completion. VS Code doesn't add import statements for new modules automatically, but once the import statement is added, VS Code provides autocomplete for this function. For Sublime Text, there are language-specific packages that can be installed to enable autocomplete. So for Python, you can install Anaconda. Anaconda provides simple name lookups and displays the expected function parameters and the comment. Another very important aspect is Git integration. And for Git integration, it's important to perform the most important actions from within the text editor without having to switch over to the terminal. And this includes common actions such as creating branches, committing code, and managing code on remotes. Both Sublime Text and Visual Studio Code have ways to integrate Git. So to summarize, both Sublime Text and Visual Studio Code are great text editors. Sublime is slightly more performant, but Visual Studio Code has better refactoring and debugging tools. It also offers a huge library of plugins and is available for free.